All right, guys, we're talking about a groundbreaking moment. Melon Kitchens is now here at the AMP here in Indianapolis. <laughs> Jeff, that big smile tells me you're excited, man. Uh, look, I'm super excited, my man. Man, and it, it is great to, to see this thing kind of coming to fruition. What's this process been like? How did it all get started? Absolutely. So, number one, Be Nimble Foundation mm -hmm. is the uplift behind the work that we're doing here with Melon Kitchens. It's our foundation that's really geared towards providing our community uh, access to opportunities and technology as well as in entrepreneurship. And when you think about accelerators and accelerating growth within the community and closing the wealth gap, we knew that entrepreneurship was important. One of the main avenues that we saw a gap or a need in was in food. So first thought was, how can we help accelerate the growth of entrepreneurs in the food space, especially coming out of the pandemic when we saw a lot of restaurants shutting down and those that really depended on having physical locations and being able to scale out their businesses, even if they were work from home, they no longer had access to that. Wow, wow. Now, that all leads to this space that we're standing in Absolutely. right now. Uh, kind of tell people how it works. Some people are like, Ghost Kitchen, what's yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. So you see it, uh -huh. but you don't really see it, right? right? And I think Ghost Kitchen is also one of those concepts that's na nationally, like, really driving growth mm -hmm. because it helps entrepreneurs in the chef in, this, in the food industry mm -hmm. really keep their costs down, right? Yeah. So they'll use a, a physical location to prepare the food, mm -hmm. one that's in health and safety protocols, that have all the certifications and the licenses that it requires to. To, to run a, a quality food business, mm -hmm. but yet they don't have those hard costs that are associated with it, right? Yeah. So they'll sell their menus virtually, sell their products virtually on various uh, platforms that allow people to sell food, and then they get to learn from us, particularly with, through our programs, how to really hone the business side uh, of the food industry. Now, Jeff, to have this all happen in the AMP, this place is buzzing, it's, it's kind of new to the area, people are still getting to know it. To have this happening in this kind of new buzzing space, uh, how do you feel like that's going to help this uh, this mission and push this forward? Absolutely. In the what I like to really call out is just the history of Indiana Avenue and this area in general. We just wanted to ensure that our community had an opportunity to participate in the growth because historically this was like the Black Wall Street of Indianapolis, yeah. right? You know, Indiana Avenue. And we wanted to, to take part in restoring that feeling. Uh, and when you think about the future of Indianapolis, it's really tied to innovation and the tech industry. So being able to combine those two things and really like infuse a program that will help uplift and scale uh, black entrepreneurs is something that was really uh, that we we're really passionate about, and we're thankful for partners like 16 Tech as well as United Way to help us really drive this this mission home. For those small restaurant owners or those dreamers who are thinking, you know, they're, they're seeing this and they're thinking maybe I could be a part of that. What would you say to say, you know what, you need to be a part of this? Absolutely. You, you absolutely do. And I think it, it starts with getting this awareness out. So I'm thankful for all of our partners that have helped. You know, that's why we're doing the grand opening, because when you see it and you see that there is an opportunity that then sparks the opportunity and the need to, to, to learn more. And our program is certainly open. We started with six chefs. But once this program uh, series is over, we'll open up applications for more chefs to be a, be a part of this program. Wow, well, man. Congrats on Melon Kitchens, man. Yeah, and, absolutely. And I can tell it's going to be something big for the city absolutely. and uh, for our local restaurants, man. So we appreciate it. Absolutely. Thank you. Yes, I appreciate sir. you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, guys. Melon Kitchens, open now at the end.